Ladies and gentlemen, today I'm going to show you how I make this 3D texture animation using After Effects. You will need Element 3D, Deep Glow, and Procedures 2. Let's get into it. First create a project, and here is my settings. Now create a text layer and make it bold for a better look. Create a solid layer by pressing Ctrl Y, or go to Layer, New, and Solid. It can be any color. Go to Effects and Presets, search for Element, and apply it to the solid layer. Now go to Custom Layers, Custom Text and Mask, and select your text. Make sure to hide the text layer. Now go to Scene Setup, select Extrude, and copy my settings. To make it easy, we're going to make the bottom side of the text first and the face last. So select Metal Grunts Dirty and copy my settings. Now select Clean Metal Brush and copy my settings. Now let's make the face of the text. Select Metal Black and follow me. Now select Extrusion Model, and let's change some settings in UV Mapping. Wait, I didn't notice this. Let's quickly fix this one. Go to Clean Metal Burst, and increase the Z Offset a little bit. And now it's fixed. After this, click OK, and go to Render Settings, and follow me. Now let's move on to the animation. Go to World Transform and set a keyframe for World Scale and change the value to 0. Now set another keyframe at around 1 second and 17 frames and change the value to 1.4. Select both keyframes and press F9 to easy use them. Now go to Graph Editor and copy my graph. Now go to Group 1, Particle Look, Multi Object, enable it. Then go to Displace XYZ, set a keyframe for X Displace, and set another keyframe here and change the value to 0.16 and easy ease them. Now set another keyframe for X Rotation and change the value to minus 250. Set another keyframe here and change it to minus 19. Easy ease them and copy my graph. Now 
again set a keyframe for rotation and change the value to minus 21 set another keyframe here set it to 29 and easy is them now to make the text explode go to scatter xyz and set keyframes for all these three and copy what i'm doing here Easy is all the keyframes and copy my graph. To make it more alive, set another keyframe here for X rotation and copy my settings in graph. If you want the explosion to last longer, you can just drag these keyframes and adjust the length according to your liking. Our animation is now finished. You will probably use this with a background, so to make it look better, pre-compose your background layer. Go to custom layer, custom texture maps and select your background layer. Then go to scene setup, select this and set the environment to your background composition. Now add drop shadow and copy my settings. Now duplicate this layer and add deep low to the top layer and copy my settings. This should be pretty much okay, but if you want to further elevate the look, you can add spotlight from layer, new, spotlight and change the color to white. Add another one with a different color. And it's done. You can still add more spotlights if you're not satisfied with the look. Add motion blur to both the 3D layers to make it look smoother. If you're too lazy like me, you can get this and more presets from my store which will be linked in the description. It will be really helpful to me if you can also support me there. And don't forget to like this video, subscribe for more. See you soon.